Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalis 4. I'm your Chief Tronka and today I will continue my Albania or Iberia achievement run. And uh, look at this, we're in Constantinople. Constantinople. And uh, the Ottomans are about to hit. They're gonna come in with like 60,000 troops. I will have 44,000 defenders. They're gonna take a negative 2 penalty for crossing. And we'll see what happens. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty confident I can win. Uh, so I will wait three more days before I move my army. Okay, he's coming. So we can hit that. And after the battle, we will have finished the siege, quite probably. Now you stay there. Finish your siege first before you do anything stupid. Alright, we got 40,000 40, men against 51,000. They have a negative 2 penalty. Uh, they have a... 2-4 leader, we got a 6-2 leader, so we get a plus 4 in fire, they get a plus 2 in shock. And um, we have better morale, they have better discipline, we have better tactics. So uh, there you go. They have more cannons, uh, but we're winning. We're winning the morale one. Just gotta be here quick. He's like, oh, I'm gonna run through. Oh, never mind, we lost the war. <laughs> we lost the battle. Okay, good job. And we have also killed the Tunisians. I guess it's safe to get my navy out here. Help locating is going to get a little bit quicker. I wonder if he's actually going to hit that. Oh, Tunisians. Okay, whatever. Just kill them. Just gotta have to pay attention. They might attack me. Who knows? And Perm lost the war to Russia. And the Golden Horde too. Oh! So Russia was at war with the Golden Horde. But uh, Ottomans didn't join, it seems like. Hmm. Interesting. And how is my aggressive expansion? Yeah, it has cooled off. 70, 68. It's cooled off. So those people will probably most likely leave. They're pissed off because they take, took Rome. And they're pretty much pissed off because they took all of these provinces. So yeah, they, they will leave eventually. Once Constantinople falls and all these provinces, then we're good. Uzbek lost. Whatever. I'm pretty confident that we can... Uh, I'm not sure if we can peace out this episode, but it's gonna get close at least. Okay, so I'm just gonna have my troops stand here. I will let them siege. That's what they're for, right? That's what vassals are, vassals are for. Sieging. Where are you going? Are you going to siege it? Otherwise, I'm gonna be really mad. Siege a province. Okay, he, he doesn't want to siege this one or this one. He wants to siege that one. <laughs> Okay, autonomy increased in Caceres and all these provinces has worn off, and that means what? He's at war with Portugal again. Great. I could reduce. Not really, because we have war exhaustion. I have to get rid of that then. First get the idea group. Get the tech. Get the tech, man. Get the tech. I should have done Western Arms Trade first with Poland. And they have rebels. They have Polish noble rebels fighting Polish reactionaries. And they just white peace. That's fine. You could have given me the province though, but that's okay. Alright, whatever. whatever. Improve relations with Poland, and then we'll have Western Arms Trade. Very nice. A great man in our employ has died, a treasurer. I will no longer have raised war taxes. I only level 2s. I don't want level 2. Okay, we could finish this. Get less idea cost and tolerance. Do it. And they've built up another 70 stack army. Great. Throw them at me. You don't dare do that.
That's my king. No, Pie Pietre. That's Pietre. They have Pietre. Okay, get him out and see chat. And my navy is scary enough to scare up the Ottomans. I like it. Yes, Poland. I'll accept. I can get a new idea. Forced labor, I will do this. Um because I'm ahead in military by quite a lot, so let's get it done right now. You don't want to attack me. Cool. 43 against 65. And Bulgaria, for some reasons, abandoned his siege. So did Byzantium. I can do this, boys. But I guess it's it's nice that you help me. It's okay. At least you, you participate in the war. I guess it wasn't that bad that they helped me. Alright. Back, boys. Back to sieging. He will take a while to re... whatever. Oh, he has a lot of man mercenaries. I mean, I have no mercenaries. It's very nice. My inflation is just terrible. Lose stability. God damn it. I don't want to. I don't want to lose stability. And France is down here. Are you done with the other wars or are you just... It's the first time he actually participates in this war. Actively, at least. He's only... Yeah, he's at war with Great Britain. About... Yeah, he's, he's going to war over Wales. That's pretty fucking dumb. But whatever. If you siege, if you help me win my war, that's good too. How much money am I making? Two ducats only. I think I'll need the uh, stability. I like stability more. Gives me less unrest in the provinces. Now what I could do, I could reduce autonomy in these provinces. In other words, very close to not being mad. Actually, these it's possible because Andalusian is accepted, and that will uh, that that will increase not only my limit but also my money. Yeah, so my manpower has increased. Everything has increased, and we siege that province down. So now you go over here, and. Uh, I could reduce it. Would need. Uh, I bump it up. Anyway. Okay, good job. How many more men do I need to reinforce? A thousand men. Okay. When will you arrive? On the twentieth. Hope you don't move. Good job. Could just be a maneuver to get over here. Who knows? No, it's not. He is actually trying to fight. We're getting sieges in really quickly. Oh my god, this is awesome. Yeah, we can win this battle. Uh, but not all of you. Unfortunately. Well, I guess it's smart that he helped me out. I would have not. I wouldn't have won. Um, so I guess what I have to do is bring these troops over here. Ship him over. Um, lose base tax in Malta. Yeah, have to accept it. Guess that's true. Utmost importance. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I wasn't paying attention there, boy. Where do you get these troops from? It's actually scary. Okay, let's, let's let's get the king in there. He has some maneuver, so we're gonna go faster. Wow, that actually uh, that's surprising. Where do you get the troops from? Hopefully, he won't crush my dudes. 
They have some morale left. And the other ones has just gotten a morale bonus, so that might be enough. At least to hold off. And Poland is Protestant, yay! Everyone turns Protestant. <laughs> or reformed at least. But uh, yeah, Austria is fighting back. They have converted three provinces. Yeah, he had to break a siege. Sorry, guy, but uh, nice for helping me out. Thanks. I got it from now. From now on, I got it. <laughs> Trust me. Okay. So, um, get this guy, the fresh one. Don't give him a leader, though. And uh, yeah, that's it. Now we should win. Whenever you think you've won, the Ottomans come from somewhere and bring a huge army. Put it right in your face. Let's check it. And Hills are low, and French Canada is low. But France is high. And I'm high. Enthusiasm. Oh, here's another army. What the heck is going on? He's bringing all his Alodia troops now to me. Interesting. I think I can uh, defend. Bulgaria keeps sieging. Cool. Good job, buddy. I guess I will take Celestia. Oh. Royal marriage with France has ended. At least give him, give him a meme it. You get meme it. There you go. Okay, proof relations with Russia, so I need to get the Royal Match with France back. And at least Portugal's being at war the entire time too. So he's not really gonna recover but he does have 40,000 men which is surprising I'm very surprised they have so many troops oh oh we've been attacked that those are my fresh troops I got it boys I got it it's fine I got it Right, if you really want to help me, who are these people? Genoa, no, 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 no. I don't know what you want. He's at war with Ferrar and Aragon. Oh, so the coalition fights itself now, finally. They're done fighting me all the time. Okay, but his attacks are being more frequent now. I have the feeling at least. It kind of sucks. Okay, come on. Uh what can we what peace can we have? We have we can get two more war, taken war score. And I guess I need to do the war fervor. War. Theodoro is at war with whom? Aragon, sure. We'll help you against Aragon. Okay, he wants white peace. Um, give me back all of Byzantium's cores. No, that's Bulgaria. I'm not gaining any... Oh, this costs points though. I don't have the points at the moment. Give me that. But who cares about this? They do care, okay. He would give me all of this. Which I've occupied, okay. So give this to Byzantium. Great Britain is done. Proof relations with Poland then. I want Western arms trade. Saxony. 
Yeah, at war with Aragon. Yay. Do that. Oh, Aragon, you suck. You got two years, man. And you're fighting Austria. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting. Okay, so they're sieging happily. I'm losing money now. Austria, you want military access? No. Sorry, bro. You're not. Ugh, God damn it. That's kind of annoying when it keeps doing that. You can't click it while it does that. Come on. Give me some control at least. It just doesn't want to. Okay. He has bought down his war exhaustion, I believe. He would say yes to all of this. Okay, so give quarters back that are missing. Well, not Sakis. That's the only one I don't really care about. He wouldn't even do these. This would be too much for him to uh, accept. Hmm. Alright, if, if I get rid of this. Okay, well he would be mad. So I will have to... Give him that. So that would be all of the Byzantium cores. If I get Sakis as well. But he would not. Yeah, we would close. He would be close to accepting that. And then I want war operations. That's what I want. That's the peace deal I want. So let's each up these provinces and then we'll, we'll do that. We'll take that. Okay, Genoa. Um, how about Siena? Can do another nine. Another nine. Approve relations. And approval relations. Just want them to like me. Come on. I think he's afraid now. He doesn't want to fight anymore. Now, once I have Moldavia, I will get all these provinces. That's good. Or actually, this might these two might be enough. And uh, in, improve relation with Byzantium. I think that's a good one. We'll have to annex him. It's gonna take a while. We I think we will immediately accept Greek culture. Then can start converting all that stuff. Regency Council. Oh! And we got the. Uh, you can probably not see it, but it's right here. We got the Die Please Die achievement. Which I think you have to have a sucky ruler um, for like. And he has to be 80 or something? Hold on. Can I, can I look at that? Rulers or something? Advisors. Blah, best leader of the world. Previous rulers. Um, so someone from until this guy, he ruled only 10 ye no, not 10, and uh, he was, he was, maybe he was 80, I don't know, at least I got the achievement, so another achievement gun, okay, cool, so I got two achievements in this, uh, that I wasn't planning on, but I got them anyway, so cool, so die, please die, and, um, what was the other one? Oh right, Vaza or Vetin. Oh, and Chernigov took two provinces off of Poland, and I just got finished my mission because we have apparently more troops than the Ottomans. Are you at war with someone else? Is that possible? No, he just can't support them anymore, I believe. Okay, accumulate money. I'll do it, even though it's useless, but I'll do it. You go over here. And my military leader Mehmet has died. 
Well, I don't need him right now. I don't want to use the points. And uh, it's the end of this episode. Well, let me let me check if I can peace out first. And uh, I cannot. Well, but I kind of want this peace deal. And I actually also want war operations. So, it's going to take a while. I'm going to hang in there for a little, little bit. Okay, anyway, that was it for this episode, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Steve Taranka, signing off.